morning, welcome to another vlog. I have no idea what day we're up to, but hello, it is Wednesday and I just got back from the gym, hence the outfit. Um, but I was talking about on my video from would have gone up Tuesday, how I was planning on making a um like veg like a tofu burger with like this big square chunk of tofu. So I figured I'd just show you. This is like a saute tofu burger with just avocado and some salad, so that's um, what I'm about to eat. It's technically breakfast because I haven't eaten anything else other than some like dried fruit this morning before the gym, but um, it's definitely more of a lunch food. I'm just going to sit down and be writing some Christmas cards, then I'm going to pop out to the shops a little later on and um, grab a few things, send out some things to the post office, all of that fun um, errand type stuff, so I'll take you along with me. Okay, so I'm back home now, and in the sliding, you can really see the sunburn mark on my nose. I think I like sunscreened the sides of my face, and obviously didn't do right down the middle. Whoops! But yeah, I'm home now from the shops. I was planning to film a little while we were there, but that just didn't happen. I was mostly just there printing some photos. I always get them done at Kmart, and they turn out great. I'm redoing the photo wall. In the kitchen but um, I'm gonna wait till the tiler is finished tiling the floors he's gonna start tomorrow and we're hoping he'll be done by Friday I'm um, sort of midday so maybe Saturday I'll put the frames all up on the wall and arrange that and um, that was my little job to help out with the kitchen but I just figured I'd sit down and show you a few things that I got at the shops um, also a little update on the Christmas tree so this is where the fridge the old fridge was a few vlogs ago and so I set up the Christmas tree over here but we've moved it round, so there's a few presents under the tree so far. But yeah, I'll just set the camera down and show you. I'm totally not in focus. It tries to focus on the Christmas tree and not on me. I know it's way cuter right now, considering this is like fully fresh face, hair 100% needs a wash, and I have no nails on right now. So yeah, I'll quickly show you what I got from the shop and then get on into what I really needed to do today. <laughs> Okay, that will do. Um, yeah, so I went to mostly get the photos printed, but I'm not going to show you any of those because it's all like family pics and whatever, boring. Um, I also needed some more Polaroid film. I just get the Instax, like the normal one, um, for my Polaroid printer. Are you choking in there or just laughing? What? Sounds like you're dying. I know, yeah. Just having a chuckle? Yes. Yeah. Okay, cute. I also had to pick up a few things from the post office. I got sent some more um, Meshki bikinis. So if you saw my um, haul, it would have been Vlogmas Day 5. Um, I got like the same top but in purple. So now I have it in pink as well. Um, and then some like high-waisted bottoms to match. I actually did prefer the like little thong bottoms I got in the purple. But I mean, these are fun too if you're feeling a little bit bloated or you just don't want to be so skimpy for once but obviously not as good for tanning because it covers up like not that I ever really tan in bikinis I just tan out of a bottle hence the yellow elbows <laughs> also I got the same bottoms in the lilac color um so I have these in black as well in the small and these are in a medium because the small are a bit too sm too small but they the black ones didn't have diamond teeth whereas these ones do so that's kind of cute and these should fit better because they're one size up. So that's really fun. Um, I have some more bikinis next to me, but these are the ones I'm actually I'm actually gonna sell a few pairs on um, Depop because I'm not I can't return them because they're swimwear and they even though I've got the like the um, lighting, the like hygiene seals are all still intact. I just they won't accept returns on bikinis for some reason, but um, they're just like not really my style. So I'll sell them on Depop. If you um, want the link is down below they're gonna be really discounted they're honestly gorgeous bikinis and I love them all they just don't suit my skin tone I don't feel like the floral yellow one um, is just like not really it's, it's just doesn't it looks amazing on darker skin and I don't have darker skin um what else did I get oh yeah my nail stuff so yesterday I actually just start this vlog yesterday on my phone but I think I'll just put the footage in now rather than do that first because I feel like it was just a bit confusing. But yesterday I went to get my lips. Sorry, just emptying out my shopping bag. I went to get my lips um, touched up at um, About Face. It's on Brighton Road if you're in SA. I love the girls there. They're all really um, fun and help 
fun. They're all really helpful and knowledgeable and I've got my lips filled like <laughs> with filler, yes, um, I have once before maybe a month or two ago yeah about about two months ago but i also got a lip flip done before that so i'll explain that well i explained that yesterday what the lip flip was but yeah i'll put in the footage of me going to get my lips done yesterday now hey everyone and welcome back to another vlog um i don't know if this is going to be up on vlogmas day 11 or 12 by the time you're seeing this but i just want to do a quick little intro because i'm actually at my um beauty therapist i don't even know what the technical term is my cosmetic injector i guess um i have gotten my lips done once in the past and i did actually film the whole thing and then my um memory card crashed and lost all the footage so great but i'm here getting not any filler today I'm doing a lip flip which is um, Botox in the upper lip it just kind of relaxes because my um, lip turns under and so you like my lips don't look huge they don't look crazy and I didn't want them to be too big and this is yeah it's not changing the size it's just gonna kind of make my lip sit up a little bit more essentially but the effects um, are quite slow so between today is like day zero and then in two weeks from now they'll be at their maximum um effect and then it wears off in like four to six weeks so i'm back for a top up it's only like 50 bucks it's technically botox but um it's not like the botox you traditionally think of because botox is actually just a ma muscle relaxant um but yeah my appointment's in three minutes so i better head in and i'll show you what it's like afterwards your kind of lips get kind of weird and it's hard to talk and drink and eat and things for a while afterwards but um come along for the ride with me i guess <laughs> actually been about an hour um they, they don't feel funny or anything yet but it does hurt at the time like they have do sort of like four injections There's like one here one there and then two on the other side as well but yeah it'll start kind of kicking in um either overnight or tomorrow and then you kind of feel like you're just drooling and that your lips are like super swelly and weird like it doesn't look weird it just feels weird so i'll show you what they look like tomorrow when it's you know begin what begun working but i also went and got my nails taken off i was gonna go get them refilled and um like repainted but while i was in there i actually just was like screw it like let's just take them off i might do some nails myself at home because i was kind of i had a vision for what i was gonna look like tomorrow when i film my christmas um outfits lookbook and i was gonna have long nails like gray nails with like little snowflakes on them and maybe some glitter and gems or whatever but I'll see if I can be bothered doing that tonight. I'm gonna to wake up and do them in the morning. But yeah, I might do some at home nails. Who knows? I've done it in the past and it turned out honestly pretty good. Like they look really good when you just do them. They just don't last that long. They fall off and you just gotta re-glue them back on again. But um, my nails are like so not cute and pretty damaged. But one of my nails on this hand was actual super damaged. Like it was, um, like bending and breaking off before I went in today so at the very least I was gonna get that one fixed and then like fill the rest but I was like you know what screw it let's just take them all off and it hurts so bad taking them off I'm normally not I'm pretty good with pain normally but this was like yeah like not fun because I just kind of like wedge them and then pull them Ugh. don't get acrylics I love them but they're a pain in the ass to you know get on and off essentially I'm off the <laughs> I'm off home now, I have some snacks, I picked up some popcorn um, to have movie night because we just signed up for Disney Plus, so I'm going to watch some Disney movies tonight, uh, well not necessarily just like Disney kids movies but um, Disney literally owns everything these days, so there's a lot on there, but yeah off home I'm going to get a frozen coke on the way and settle in for the night. Because after that, I was planning on going to get my nails redone. I 
had acrylics until yesterday, but after my appointment, I was kind of running a bit late. And then I got to the shops and I didn't have time to really get them redone the way I wanted them. And also I feel like the nail places I've been going to have just been the very generic ones and I wanted kind of like nail art. So I've decided that I actually got my acrylics all taken off. So now my nails look really not cute. They're super short and like brittle and anyway. So I kind of wanted to do my nails last night, but um, they were still kind of tender. If you've ever had acrylics, you know that when you take them off, they're pretty tender underneath. So I didn't do that just yet, but I'm going to do them today. I got all my acrylic stuff out and realized that, oh no, I totally didn't need these. Are you laughing at me? Huh? Oh, your phone. What? Don't worry. I just heard you laughing and I couldn't tell if you were laughing at me or at your phone. Laugh now? No. Do you want me in the video? <laughs> Cute. Okay, so uh, shut up. Okay, what I was trying. <laughs> Fuck off. Now I'm gonna have to bleep that out. I did get all my nail stuff out last night though and realized that I actually don't have any acrylic liquid so I had to get another set of this. Um, I don't need the powder or anything but I do need the liquid and they don't sell the liquid on its own. I'm sure you can get it on Amazon or whatever but I needed it today. So I've um, got this. I actually got some more nails but I didn't need these. I should have left these behind. And also um, just some like regular stick on ones from Kmart. These ones you don't actually need the um, acrylic stuff though. They just like glue okay so these ones i actually got as well just for like days that i didn't come well like, you right though so i have these two packs as well for days that i can't bother doing my nails fully but i do want to have nails they fall off a lot easier and that's because they're just like glued on whereas this stuff is a lot stronger and does tend to last longer but it's a lot more effort so i'm gonna give this a try um possibly now i think i'm gonna just wash my hair because i'm feeling kind of like ugh, right now so I'm gonna finish my iced coffee put this stuff away wash my hair and then sit down and do my nails so that I can film because I just feel I mean I've, I've been meaning to film my um, Christmas party lookbook thing this week but I just keep putting it off because I had the purple nails and now I have no nails and I did I want to have like slightly Christmassy nails for the video which is totally not that important but it's just yeah I feel would feel better waiting to have my nails done, then filming it with hands like this. Okay, it's much later on now. My nails are all done. Um, they're not awful, but they're definitely not the best. I feel like this hand looks a little bit cuter, but um, obviously it would have looked better if I'd gotten someone who was professional to do them, but, but hey, I gave it a go. I'm just going to close this video out here because I'm honestly in the absolute worst mood. I have no idea why. I'm just feeling like crazy all over the place, like mad mood swings. So I think it's just about time that... And my camera does not want to focus on me today. Maybe I need to clean the lens or something. But I think it's about time I close this video out. I don't even know what this whole vlog was. Essentially just me doing my nails and talking about my lips. They still don't feel any different, so... I guess it's a good thing, maybe it's a bad thing. I don't know. We'll see in two weeks if they actually look any different than they did yesterday. But either way, thank you for watching. And I'll see you tomorrow with a brand new video. I don't know what it's going to be at this point. I'm hoping tomorrow I'm going to be able to film my outfits video. But we do. We are going to have the Tyler here all day. So I don't know how I'm going to go about filming that. But if I can get it up for you on Friday, I will. But thanks for watching and see you tomorrow with something. Bye.